The Alpha engine's been rebuilt. It's uh, an Alpha Romeo 1.7 Cloverleaf. Um, delivers about 110 brake horsepower, or supposed to according to the specifications. Quite a compact little unit. This is uh, the, th the second Alpha engine I've had. Um, it's been in the car running before, prior to its rebuild. It's now ready to go back inside the car. As you can see, it's quite a compact little unit. It fits in very nicely. I've made an aluminium bulkhead plate to tidy it up and also cut down some of the noise that goes into the passenger compartment. The engine's ready to be pushed onto the splines now. I've made up a rear engine mount bracket which bolts to the main chassis. As you can see it fits in quite nicely and the, the exhausts are on and mounted. The exhausts have been designed to give it a nice deep throaty noise to it when it starts up and also when you rev it so it's, uh, it's, it's a little bit noisy but it's been designed that way. As you can see once all the ancillary components are put onto the engine it uh, fills the engine bay up but you can still get some access to it, it's not so bad. now ready for the main starting. As you can see it revs quite well. Three revving engine now. When it's idling you get that uh, very deep approaching to it. One of the hydraulic tappets is a little bit noise there, it's just wearing in. It's been standing, the engine was standing for a while before I got back to the UK to fit it. And you've got that nice twin slash cut exhaust Ferrari look. 